So guys, maybe you've seen the last video where I brought Gaio to the house and I was telling you about that I wanted to start the process of riding it on the necro. It would be very cool if one day he could be riding without the bridle and go on the necro, but everything hasn't been so easy yet, so I didn't really see that happening anytime soon. Last time in the video I tried a little bit with the bridle still on and have a, a necro around the neck and I only walked and did like a second of trot. Um, but he was quite okay with it and then yesterday during my ride I tried a little bit with the neck rope again, I did some trot and some more like uh, circles and all these kind of things and it made me so excited and I wanted to make this process kind of like a long video series where it might have taken like quite some time before we got there but yesterday it felt actually like really nice so I can't really wait so I decided to bring him back home straight away today and we're just gonna try. I mean I first have to see how he will be today. It's Halloween. <laughs> If he is sweet, we're just gonna give it a good old go. All right, we're all tacked up. I've got Matt here. I came to, to see this chaos. For the rescue, if needed. Uh, so I really have no idea how it will go come and walk to the arena. Because, I don't know. I'm kind of matching with him. You are, yeah. Maybe you should do it. We're all in these autumn colors. No, I'm not doing it. Hell no. What do you think about like the thought of Gaia on Necro? I don't like the idea of it because when you work with him in Liberty, he really throws the head and that kind of stuff. So I don't really like the idea of him having that crazy freedom in the neck and stuff. And then you're also trying to control him. I don't like that. But this will be chaos for sure. Do you think I it's no going to work out well? Um, I think so because you know what you're doing. And I don't think you would do it unless you feel that he's ready. I think sometimes it is but like this when you have like, it can either, yeah. either take a long time, but it can also one day to the other day, you can like have a feeling inside. You're like, okay, now it's ready. Maybe he's even going to be better than with the bridle. All maybe. the options are there. Or maybe you'll go through the fence. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus, this chaos is beginning. Come on. Okay. Can, can you get you, on like uh, that? This one? So Gaio is really a horse that is... Hey, no, no, no. He's eating it. Yeah, but it's autumn. Oh, okay. Oh, we're off to a great start. For... Love it. You sit and we're piaffing. Oh. True relaxation. <laughs> great Maybe. for necro. <laughs> I'm like in the impact zone. Oh. Where do you want, what do you want to do? Last time it's quite relaxed, so maybe you can close the... Yeah, oh, definitely, yeah. But do you want to come in first? Yeah, first what? wait till he waits. Good boy. Good boy. Easy. <laughs> God, what's more. happening? So he started off a little bit more stressed than last time, but I did like five minutes of trot and he's already getting a bit better. So we're just gonna see how today will go. What are your thoughts now? Um, he looks good. He looks more relaxed, I think. Yeah. Um, so that gives me more confidence because he was feeling a little nervous when he entered the arena. Boy. But this looks better. Like yesterday when I did the neck rope at first he was very confused and after a little while he got like quite good. The only thing that I'm not really sure about because you can ride with the neck rope without the reins and the horse is fine but then sometimes like for example Gaia when you take like a halt or a bridle off he might want to run. So that's the only thing I will stress most about the moment that thing comes off. But as I said it's a process video so we're gonna just go with the flow. Oh, good boy. Now I just want again if I don't have anything on the range that he doesn't do like straight away up like this. Has Emporio ever had like issues with if you let go of the range that he goes straight up? No. Because that's <laughs> been always like quite an issue like with him. I think he's a little bit of a horse that goes against the pressure and Emporio is not really yeah. that. Okay, maybe I do one little canter. Oh yeah, oh for sure. And awesome. I don't think you should canter on neck rope. I, no, we'll see how it goes. Oh no, I just don't know what's going to happen if he does want to run. So people, if you're going to do this, make sure you feel ready. I know I make all these jokes, but you never know just when you take it off. Who are we going to see? Okay. How does he feel? I mean, not yet as yesterday, but do you think? It can really be good for his mindset and us for to have something completely new, make it really fun and positive. And hopefully he will just be very proud. You're like sitting there like a teacher. Yeah. But you're not saying much. I'm taking it in. 
taking it all in. Right. It's also really important to say that for anybody who's watching this, you don't just stick an egg rope on your horse at home and hope for the best. That can be also really dangerous, even with my horse, who's quite good. <laughs> Um, I was out of control and I had to throw myself off the horse. Should we just uh, maybe put the neck rope on and then I'm gonna see? Yeah. And I have the neck rope around the neck, obviously. And the reins are loose, so I'm just gonna see if I can do some steering and stopping. That is a good beginning. Just use my body as normal. Good boy. What's the like, let's say the horse gets confused and he panics and he's not stopping, what do you do? Well, then you have the reins. Nate. No, okay, I get that now, but when you're on neck rope, what oh. is the emergency break? Oh, I mean, you can put the neck rope a little bit higher up, but otherwise try to see if you can get onto a circle, even that might sometimes Just be like a, as small of a circle as you can get to bring them back. Yeah. Yeah. And don't panic. Yeah, don't panic. <laughs> <laughs> now I just want to make him like really happy and proud every time he like understands what I mean. Boy. And I kind of... Oh, oh Lord. Yeah, I just really hope he's not going to be like bolting. Good boy. Yeah. But he likes it a lot. I've got such a proud feeling, so I believe in him. And we're going to have a great ride. And I already imagine a really cool photo next week or something. Because look, if I ask him to see if he wants to be a bit more. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Wow. Woo! Good boy. That's good. I see potential there. <laughs> like yesterday at first he wasn't really sure. Oh. But then you just keep asking. Yeah. Not just like hanging. Yeah. And I oh. think also lots of transitions. Oh. You also always do that a lot in the beginning. It's so good. Okay, the other way. Oops. Uh. <laughs> I almost want to know how he will react like this when he gets scared. So I would almost ask somebody to kind of like make him spook. We're not doing it, but then I, I know. I can do it. Yeah, I'm sure you can, but then I don't want to do it because he will stay nervous. But then I know if I can get him back if it happens. Yeah, a little bit more collected trot. Yeah, he's biting the rain. Lay it up, it's so, it's so. Ah, more your. Woohoo! <laughs> Good boy. Do one canter like this, just in case he goes into canter without the bridle. Good. It's not bad, right? No, that's pretty good. Can you come back to a halt from the canter? Ooh. 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 Look at this. Yeah. Wait, come on. I'll try from walk to canter, as you said. Yeah. Also good for training, but also just to see how if these things happen. What We're just testing the waters. Seeing how... Oh. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. We're just Antic? testing the waters. To yeah. See. yeah. The reins are going everywhere. It's a bit nicer. This horse with these <laughs> lips. He doesn't bite, but he's always like. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Okay, I'm a little nervous, um, but I'm very excited because I think this will really like give us a nice drive. But I am a bit I'll nervous. I have to say. Oh, but no, but gently, please. This is a really big thing, you know. Yeah. Like. Two years almost, I've been riding him, and it's like, as I said, not Ooh. always been super easy. Oh. <laughs> but not always Me been... posing for oh, the sorry. thumbnail while you talk. It's a really big deal to have no bridle on. Do you I want got me look? to walk next to you for a second? So then he thinks like, he's not just thinking like open world? I think it's fine. I think I just see like, act normal. Okay. Thanks. Okay, first gonna see always if I can back up still. Do I have a break? Yippee. <laughs> oh, good luck. Did you ever expect this? <laughs> Yes, with you, I've learned to expect the unexpected. Oh my god, I'm riding on neck rope. Ah! Okay, come, stay focused, yeah? This is I don't so want you to get hurt. This is so exciting. Oh, <coughs> oh. Next minute bolting. <laughs> well, how does it feel for you? Fine, he feels kind of like with me. He's pushing more against the neck rope now a little. I think he's just no, like... No, it's oh. easier in trot. I think the walk is always a bit harder. Yeah. Like, oh, the stopping is still fine. Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna see him trot. Oh god. <laughs> this is what. Oh Good boy. Oh god, the anxiety. Yeah. I'm getting a phone call. So I just need to keep him calm. <laughs> so I'm going. <laughs> yeah. What a talent he is. Good boy. 
<laughs> it's better than giving us his all straight away. Yeah, good boy. He's very playful. Like if I pet him too much, he will start being like jumpy. But that's okay. Yeah, I think he likes it. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah, Nate. Good. Good. Oh. <laughs> so yeah, it's a very fine line. But I just try to keep him a little bit in the collector trot because then I have him with me a bit more. Later, when it feels fine, I might try a bit more normal. But you just need to take step by step where your horse feels good, comfortable. Wow, he feels much softer in his whole body. Yeah? Like, my legs are like being more like listened to. Play it up. Good boy. Yeah. Okay, I'll turn the other way. Careful. Easy. Boy. It looks good, but you, I think they can see a little bit what we meant now with the head, that it sometimes just oh, yeah, but gets thrown around. And that's the only bit that scared me a little bit with him yeah. on Necro, because then I think he's not really listening, so. Yeah, but for now, I mean, this is the first time I'm very proud. No, 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 this is going yeah. really good. I thought it would be way worse. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but I get what you mean, because when you get the shaking, wow, uh, you get the jumps. Boy. Wow, good, it's super. Easy. Ooh. <laughs> Let up. Yeah. Wow, boy, boy. Just some padding in <laughs> the ear. Let up. A bit more normal trot with some good frame. Yeah. So, your reaction, huh? I'm quite impressed. I think he's doing really, really good. Maybe I'm gonna become a necro guy. Because <laughs> sometimes I like Andres is also better on necro. I'm like, either it's a good thing. You're slowly gonna stop riding. First you were riding with a, with a bit, then bitless, then no, then no bit necro. Then you're just not even gonna be on the horse. Why? Lay it up. What I like with the necro also is that um, once you've asked something, there's nothing then. Like it's it's either you're on or you're off. There's no holding, which is really nice. Really Should I do a canter? Well, <laughs> Kim. well, I hope that he's ready for that. But if you think he's I don't ready, know, because yeah. canter is always a bit tricky. Should I? Yeah, I think so. Just be careful. Yeah. Yeah. Easy. It's like I'm on Mistral. <laughs> okay, Alize. <laughs> Hey, this is listen. what gets me worried is the canter. This is when I went flying. I'm not sure yet. I first do some sitting ease. ease. I first do some good boy. He had a break. Just do some sitting ease. trot. I don't know about the canter yet. We'll see. And that's I think what's important is you really have to listen yeah. to the horse and what, what they're telling you and when they're ready. Because now he's already going a little bit through the neck group at first. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So he's finding a little bit. Ooh. But it's a good thing, I have a break, easy, Ooh -hoo. even in the canter. I think you can see he has a little bit more stress in the sit trot. Yeah, so He's I think just anticipating a little bit more action. The canter will be one for the next time. We still need something to look forward to. Yeah. And this is already such, such a big step. Yeah. Maybe well. it's good if you try and go full arena and just do some serpentines and really easy bending. Let's see if he can do some stretching in the neck. Oh, it's always a bit easy. easy. It's so, uh, yeah. And how are you inviting that? Just by bringing the neck rope a little bit lower and loose? Well, it sounds stupid, but I just think about it. Okay. So you just put the energy into it. And sometimes what you can do is like little questions or help there a little. Yeah. But it's all just about asking very little things and knowing what you want. And then when you get like the slightest thing in that direction, yeah, you let them know that was good. Good. And then eventually he starts. The horse whisperer. 
<laughs> oh, I'm not whispering. <laughs> oh. I'm like the horse yellow then. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, it's easy. Okay. Oh, thank you. That was a huge step and it went so much fast. I thought this is a moment for weeks. Um, oh, but he did so well, like yesterday you felt good. And I mean, this is the very first time on neck rope, so it's crazy. Like normally, if you have the first time on neck rope, you're already happy where you can, <laughs> yeah, where you can do some walk, trot, and maybe canter, but he's even like reacting to like the normal eight. And you had a little canter, not by choice, but you felt, <laughs> you felt <laughs> a little jumps. bit what it was like. I thank you guys for watching. I hope you liked it. Um, we're definitely gonna keep practicing and we'll like uh, keep sharing the process of it all. So thank you. And I'm really proud and have a really good day. See you in the next one. Bye. Bye. -bye.